Hi, good morning everyone. Let's get started with next training topic for this session which is on export directory structure and files in an ABAP system. It's extremely important to understand the export directory structure that is what type of directories and files are created when you dump or export the data out of the source system so that you can find out which package is exported in which particular location and in which directories of files you need to look for it okay just to identify that everything has been exported successfully okay so let's get into the directory structure okay here you can see that using sap INST when you perform an export this is the structure this is the format in which the export dump is is created okay here you can see that under the install directory you have package.command package.tsk and package.log files and under the dump directory folder you have db folder and there is this is one very important file ddl see for oracle it will be ddl ora.tpl and under that you have package.ext db size.xml and table type.sql okay and so this is under db folder so this is extremely important and under data folder you'll find three important type of files package.str package.toc and package.nnn okay so these are few files which is extremely important and in the installation folder you have command package.command package.tsk and package.log files are generated okay so just take note of these three different locations where these files are present okay so the star.str star.toc and the dump files are stored in the data directory that we have seen and all ext files are stored in the corresponding database folder okay then you have ddl ora.tpl file under db folder and all the import file will read the content of label.esc to verify that the dump directory location is correct Okay, so that is in pretty much the content or the directory structure of a dump or an OSDB export. That's what pretty, pretty much I wanted to share with you guys. Thank you for joining and have a nice day. Bye-bye.